Today marks such a joyous occasion for this couple. Aaron and Tracy's friendship was the conduit for their love. And because of this, their relationship will stand the test of time. We are here today before God because marriage is one of his most holiest and sacred wishes to witness the joining and marriage of Aaron and Tracy. This occasion marks the celebration of love and commitment with which this man and this woman begin their life together. Tracy, I love you. You're kind, beautiful, smart, and funny. Thoughtful, caring, sincere, and honest. And very, very, very patient. <laughs> You're my best friend, and I can't imagine a life without you. I love you. Aaron, I always felt so drawn to your kind heart. I have never known someone with the kindness and love that you have for others. I look up to you, admire you, and feel so incredibly lucky that after all this time, it's you standing here today. I know you're tenderhearted, which is something I love so much about you, but I promise to protect that sweet heart of yours now and forever. I love you, Aaron. The Almighty God, I now pronounce you man and wife. May your days be long upon this earth, and may they be well with you both. You may now kiss your bride, Aaron. I now present to you all for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Aaron McClellan. came home one day with a book on hypnosis and uh, his, his grand plan was to uh, have Josh learn to hypnose, uh, hypnotize this girl that he, was, he had a crush on to make her fall in love with him. And uh, unfortunately the plan backfired because she fell in love with Josh instead. So I just want to say cheers. Here's to you, Aaron. Thanks. I'm glad you finally read the hypnosis book for yourself <laughs> and it paid off. Love you guys. the sense that Chase would have made a more natural older child than me um, and indeed I've learned so much from her example she works endlessly for the causes that she believes in she is fiercely loyal and thoughtful and protective of those that she loves Aaron, we are over the moon that you and Chase found each other um, your kind heart your gentleness strength and compassion are all that I could have ever hoped for for Tracy Tracy and Aaron, it's telling to both of your characters that there are so many good humans here today gathered to celebrate you. Um, so I ask all of you now as well, raise a glass to Tracy and Aaron. Yay! <laughs> Aaron, welcome to the family and you're, all your family, welcome to our family as well. God bless you. And all I kept thinking about was this song, and it was popular then, and it was called You Light Up My Life by Debbie Boone. And I tell her in that story every year. She does light up my life. <laughs>
am overwhelmed when we look around and just see so many friends and family from different chapters of our lives. Just the support and love that you've given both of us individually and as a couple throughout our lives to bring us to where we are today is just absolutely incredible and we could not be more thankful to have such amazing people in our lives. Everything that she said, thank you. <laughs> no, no. Thank you.